We come whenever there's a new show to be hung. We're usually confronted with a great big pile of chaos, which is a hundred paintings or even more to be hung on the walls. The gallery has just gotten to be bigger and better and more organized than ever. We have been experiencing an education. Our jobs are to come in and to prepare them for hanging on the walls. That includes the process of figuring out where things are going to go, how they look together, making sure it all works. So that when you come in, it, it looks like it really ought to be that way and it can't be any other way. So by December, we pretty much had all the pieces chosen. It's over 100 pieces. And then comes the building the show. It's a tremendous amount of satisfaction to be able to put together a show that really, really looks good. And it's a, it's a huge challenge. You don't have a clue of what goes into it. It's like a theater production. You want to create a nice flow and a nice transition from one artist to another. Oftentimes we will start with matching up frames rather than names to get sizes right. The framing is part of it. I mean, I love the framing part because you get to see up close and personal, so many different pieces of art. Yeah, it's kind of like putting together a jigsaw puzzle. Really good to get it together, get it right the first time. It's a, a tremendous challenge to take all these disparate works and um, make them all look great. We look at our wall that is now empty and we try to pick a signature piece that will start in the middle of the room, in the middle of the wall, and then we can build around that wall. I love working with the artwork. I love seeing it all and seeing what other people are doing. Paintings that Mary and Alden left, they're now getting finely framed and organized and prepared so that they can be shown to the world, really. It's like being in a candy store, actually, you know, because <laughs> you're just, you know, looking through all this amazing work. There was a lot to pick from, and so we tried to pull together a collection that we thought was representative of her work and her devotion to art. 